Morning folks, this one's quite a special job. You won't remember this tree, I do. It was this high when we planted it, Trachycarpus fortuni. Love it, very tropical, very Mediterranean almost. Yes, it's quite a beast now. I'm actually stood in where the hot tub used to be and this was a beautiful cedar decking area. Well, the client didn't really use the hot tub, so about a year ago he got somebody to remove it and realised that there was a bloody great big hole in the middle of the decking. So he got them to remove the decking as well. So, look at this. This is all cedar. Cedar posts, in concrete, in the ground, solid as a rock. That is incredible. 17 years. Not quite sure where the bamboo came from, but the fatsias Look at the size of these. These were, everything was really tiny. These were minuscule and these formiums. I mean, look at the size of this thing over here. Monster. It's coming out now though. We're gonna put some new paving down here. We're gonna continue this path in this beautiful limestone. That's gonna come up to the cedar cabin. Maybe have a bench. Bench sat here surrounded by plants. We have got about 35 square metres of planting to put in. Some people may love this scheme, some people may not. These are a bit too big. Yeah, they look really impressive, but they're too overpowering. Trying to be something that it perhaps um, doesn't need in this very small space. So we're going to get rid of some of these formiums. We're going to clear this and we're going to create a beautiful white flower based tropical garden. So tune in next time and you'll be able to see how we're getting on. Bye-bye.